All right, it is back to school week here on Daytime, and today we're talking about sparking creativity, jewelry making, ceramics, printmaking, and so much more. Young artists can nurture their creativity and sharpen their artistic skills at Lil Street Art Center. I spoke with their team to learn how your student can thrive in this creative space. Lowell Street is an art education center as well as community space located in the Lively Malt Road district of Ravenswood. Um, we offer a variety of classes um, ranging from first time, intermediate, beginner, advanced. So whether you're somebody who's curious about trying something out for the first time or maybe you're an artist who wants to try a new medium or you're an expert level artist just looking for maybe a new approach to a technique or a way to experiment within your medium, we've got you covered. One of our largest departments here is ceramics, and that's actually how Lil Street started, was as a, a clay studio that then offered ceramics classes, and then once we were here, they were really able to flourish with the classes that we offer. We have over 50 classes happening at the same time, or within the same session. We have wheel throwing as well as hand building classes. And something that's great about our studios are they are the largest studios for an independent art school in Chicago. So you can really spread out. You can take a variety of classes. We have different kilns that offer different heat settings and different finishes to the ceramics that you're working with. We have over 25 glazes and surface designs. And when in combination, they can create an endless possibility of colors and patterns and surface designs for your work. We have expert instructors, teaching assistants, and studio monitors, as we do with every department. We just redid our metal studios. Our department director, Kat Boyer, as well as our previous artist in residence, Peter Antor, helped to redesign the studio spaces. So we have three large studios all up to date with ventilation. There's special areas where you can do enameling, as well as having your own private studio space. We have our printmaking and book arts department, and we do print on paper, book binding, letterpress. We have our textiles department, which is my domain, and we have everything from sewing to screen printing on fabric to natural dye. We have our drawing and painting department. We offer a range of classes from figure drawing to mixed media. And then we just opened our digital arts programming. So we're starting out small, um, but our risograph classes have been a really big hit, as well as our zine making classes. We also offer Kid Street classes, which are happening throughout the year, after school, during the weekends, as well as during the summer. And that's a really popular group of classes for kids from ages 3 up to 13. And we also have family workshops included with that too. And we have a range of multimedia classes, clay, sewing, painting, drawing, collage, um, everything to keep your kiddo interested and engaged. We have a little gallery center where you can purchase pretty much everything you see that has a tag on it. A lot of it is ceramics, but we also do um, some jewelry pieces like small metals, earrings, necklaces, um, rings and stuff too. A lot of it is made by our faculty, Little Street alumni, as well as some Little Street students. This is a space we recently started developing to sort of give our students and staff like a cozy place to unwind, catch up on their own work, and connect with other like-minded individuals. Um, behind me here, you see we have a mural made by a longtime collaborator, Paul G. Sumner. One of the most important aspects of Low Street is that it serves as a community space. So it's not just um, a place to like grow and learn. You're also here to like make friends and like plant your own roots. Almost forms like a second family, I would say. For more information <clears throat> about Lil Street, scan the QR code on your screen. You can also pay them a visit in person, give them a call, or go to their website at lilstreet.com. Don't forget to follow them on Instagram at Lil Street, and they'll have an events coming up, such as a magic show, ceramic crawl, and they are participating in this year's Ravenswood Arts Walk on September 14th and 15th with live demonstrations.